welcome back to North Kitsap Baptist Church Kids Sunday School. I'm so glad you could come this morning. Go grab your Bible. We're going to read a story out of the New Testament today. We're going to be in the book of Matthew. That's the first book in the New Testament. Well, have you ever had a really special occasion or special thing you were going to go do? And you were so excited. You were looking forward to it so much. Maybe you had to get all dressed up in something fancy, wear your best clothes. Maybe your mom, you know, did your hair up real special, and you were getting so excited. It was something that was going to be an awesome time, and it was just almost hard to wait for that special time to come. Well, today we're going to talk about some kids who were very excited for a special occasion. Well, there were parents in a town back in Jesus' day, and they were really excited. Do you know why? They heard Jesus was coming to their town to tell them important things that they needed to know about God. And they all wanted to go and meet Jesus. They wanted Jesus to pray for their children. And so they probably called their children and said, hurry, let's get ready to go see Jesus. Maybe they put on their special clothes. Maybe they packed a lunch because they had to travel a ways. They maybe washed their face and brushed their hair. So they were all ready to go. So they walked down the road to where Jesus was meeting with people in their town. And I bet as these people got closer and closer to where Jesus was, crowds of people were there. Have you ever been in a big crowd with your mom or your dad? Lots of people. Maybe they hold on to your hands so you don't get separated. And it's hard to see past all those people. Maybe you try to look around them, or if you're short enough, look through their legs and see what's going on. Or maybe your mom or dad will put you up on their shoulders so you can see over their head. Well, I'm sure it was a really big crowd, and the children were doing their best to look and see if they could see Jesus. That was the whole reason they were there. But I'm sure the moms and dads were trying to maneuver through the crowds and get closer and closer so that they too could talk to Jesus and have Jesus pray over their children. But suddenly, something unexpected happened. Jesus' helper said, stop. Jesus can't see your children now. He's busy. Oh, I bet they felt so disappointed. They'd been looking forward to this so much. So they probably turned around with a sad heart, ready to go back home without seeing Jesus. But then they heard a voice. It was Jesus' voice, and he said, Let the children come to me. Do not send them away. Children can show us what it really means to be part of God's family. Oh my goodness, their hearts must have been so happy. They got to see Jesus. So they went over to where Jesus was, and they probably were able to hug him and stand next to him. And if they were little, sit on his lap. And he talked to the children, and he prayed over them. Imagine how loved they felt. And the parents were probably very glad that they got the chance to bring their children to see Jesus. So I'm sure they learned a lot that day. And it was a very special occasion. And they will remember, they would have remembered that whole experience the rest of their life. Well, Jesus showed love by welcoming those children. He was glad to see them. And you know what? He loves you and he's glad to be with you too. He cares about what happens to you. The Bible says, let the little children come to me. That's Matthew 19, 4. Um, So you can go to Jesus in prayer. He may not be standing in your town like a person that you can see, but he's right there with you. And just like last week, you can pray and you can know he hears you and loves you. Well, we'll see you back here next week. I'll be looking forward to sharing more with you. Have a good week.